Hi, my name is Uchidi. This channel is all about fun art challenges. I hope through these challenges I can improve my art skill and share my journey with you. For today's challenge, I'll be making a Spotify plaque with plexiglass. Let's see how it goes. I thought it would be cool to make something that I could give as a gift. So like I said, today I'm going to make a Spotify plaque with this plexiglass. But I wanted to make it a little more creative, so I made a frame that can hold three layers of the plexi. See, there are three grooves here. And the plexi will fit in it like this. And of course, I will use Polska pens again this time, and I have an idea of how I wanted it to come out in my head but I'm a little worried that the pens won't work well on the plexi. But let's do it. Starting with the very back layer, I am drawing on the front side of the plexiglass this time as I'm not familiar to painting it from the back side. At this point, I think you can obviously tell I will do something related to slam dunk. You can also see my sad desk light with the tracing paper as a diffuser. It usually works well, but it doesn't look cool with plexi. I'm just painting everything in orange, so let's go ahead and skip this for now. My idea is the frame with the slam dunk fan art and to make it related to slam dunk with the theme song on Spotify. That I will explain in just a bit. Moving on to the second layer, which is the very front layer. This is essentially what makes it as a Spotify plaque. Basically, I will draw or trace the information of the theme song from slam dunk along with the Spotify code that allows you to scan it from the Spotify app to find the song and to listen to it. I was surprised that the code doesn't have to be that accurate and as you can see, the rough lines are more than enough. As long as you have the three lines in a circle on the very left, which is the Spotify logo. Now I'm whitening out the backside so it can easily be readable, but I start to realize the Posca pens is no good for painting in a solid color unless you are skilled. The strokes are so obvious. The final layer is where I draw my favorite, Sakuragi Hanamichi. Speaking of slam dunk, I used to live by the Shonan area where this anime is set in and used to go to the beach area often. The area is very nice and if you already have been to Tokyo and Osaka, maybe it's a good idea to visit there next time as it's actually easily accessible from Tokyo. Anyway, let's see the final piece. This is the final piece. I know it's not good. I guess I should have used normal acrylic paint for the solid paint parts, though using Posca pens for the outlines was okay on Plexi. And my Japanese lettering still sucks. Anyways, let's test out the Spotify code. Yep, it works. Though I shouldn't play the music for copyright reason. Well, this is not giftable quality, but I think something like this is a good gift with a Spotify gift card rather than the card by itself. If you're inspired by this, I'm sure you can do a much better job than I did. That's it for this time. Thank you for watching my video. If you liked the video and would like to see more, please like or leave a comment below. And if you really liked the video, please subscribe. See you next time.